Well, today, Louisiana Senator Bill Cassidy is back in Senlaw for the North Rapids Business and Industry Alliance meeting. Senator Cassidy spoke on broadband internet, social security, and the great partnerships he has with communities in the Pelican State. We got a partnership here. Louisiana Senator Bill Cassidy back in central Louisiana to speak on his drive to create better infrastructure and more jobs for the Pelican State. It's his second appearance in Senlaw since speaking at the Central Louisiana Chamber of Commerce's congressional luncheon in July. Every time you come, you want to talk about the possibilities of how we can work as partners uh, from the federal, state, and local level to make Central Louisiana a better place to live, where someone's more likely to, to, to live their dream, to, to build a business, or to be gainfully employed, to, to have a, a place where their children and grandchildren stay. I'm going to keep on coming back and talking about that. The Louisiana Senator spoke on the second phase of Gumbo 2.0, which will bring internet access to nearly 100,000 homes, 35,000 businesses, and 4,000 institutions, such as hospitals, law enforcement agencies, and schools. He says Rapides Parish is eligible for the second most amount of money from the Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act, which has $1.35 billion in federal dollars attached that has to be used by the end of the year. The amount, according to Senator Cassidy, sums up to $24 million eligible for Rapides. But there's a lot of people here who would qualify, but who do not yet have high-speed affordable internet. Senator Cassidy also spoke on his efforts to repeal the windfall elimination provision and the government pension offsets, two government programs that a Louisiana Congressman Gary Graves announced on Monday will work to repeal. Keeping those government programs would reduce Social Security benefits for state and local government retirees, according to Cassidy. But if you're one of those Social Security beneficiaries and all of a sudden you don't get any benefit when your spouse dies, uh, it's being laid on your back. To fix that costs $7 trillion over 75 years. Senator Cassidy hopes to expand on the partnerships with Louisiana moving forward.